Hey everyone, it's Lila here and welcome back to my channel. In this video, I will be showing you how to create this cute honeycomb charm with tiny bees. Please don't forget to subscribe, like and share. So let's go and let's get crafting. First, let's make the tiny bees. Get a tiny piece of yellow clay and create a little teardrop shape. This will be the body of the bee. And then, Get the black clay and cut a small piece and then roll it into a small sausage. Then cut the top bit of the yellow clay and then attach the black clay to create the head of the bee. Now roll a tin snake of black clay. We will be using this to create the stripes of the bee. Cut it into small pieces and then attach it to the body. When attaching the stripes, you can use a liquid clay if you have one. To create the wings, Get the white clay and cut two small pieces and create two teardrop shapes. Then attach the wings to the body. Again, you can use liquid clay in doing this. You can add some details to the wings by indenting lines using a craft knife, like what I'm doing now. Now, let's create a bee balm. To do this, get a yellow clay and shape it into a half a sphere. And then, add a stripe by rolling a black clay into a tin snake and wrapping it around the body. This can be tricky and fiddly, so take your time in doing this. To create a little tail, get a black clay and create a cone shape like I'm doing now. And then add an indent using a bow tool and attach the tail. And once it's done, bake it according to package's instructions. Let's create the honeycomb. 
get the vessel charm and stuck it down to the tape. Make sure to press it firmly to avoid any leakage. Next, mix the UV resin and the yellow pigment. And then add the resin to the charm. To make it look realistic, you can leave some gaps. And once you're happy with it, cure it with a UV lamp. You can also make a dripping effect by adding a bit of resin at the bottom of the charm and then cure it again with a UV lamp. Once you are happy with how it looks, take the tape off. Let's move on to the cutest part, adding the tiny bees. Before adding the bees, make sure it has cooled down. Add a bit of resin on where you want to place the bee. And then, get a pincer and carefully add and position the bees. And then cure it for the last time. If you want to turn it into a charm, you can add a clasp or add it to a chain if you want to turn it as a necklace. That's it guys, I hope you enjoyed crafting with me today and please don't forget to subscribe, like and share. Thank you for watching, I'll see you again on my next video.